it's Ann over at Plant Obsessed. Today I'm going to look in on my no grit bin and see what we're doing. This bin has got my regular compost uh, worms in it. Red wigglers, blue worms, European nightcrawler mix. Seems to have dried out a little bit here on the top. But we're going to get that all mixed up and everything will be lovely. It's pretty wet underneath. I've been trying to add some more worms to the group um, with my baiting containers and uh, trying to get a larger concentration, but it's funny, they haven't moved out of the bait containers. <laughs> like, come on guys, join the join your friends. Uh, thing, same thing over here. This was a bait container <laughs> and there they are. At some point you guys, you're just gonna get evic evicted. All right, get these guys in there. So just looking at them, they look like they're very healthy. Uh, still seeing good sized worms. Trying to look to see if I see any cocoons. If you see any cocoons, let me know in the comments. One of the principles about needing grit is that they need it for their cocoons um, or the calcium for the cocoons or, or something. I know it's for their gizzards so that they can eat food, but some people have mentioned that they think that it also helps um, them reproduce. So if you see any cocoons in there, I'm not seeing any. Hmm. Not as of yet. Yeah. Oh, wait, there's one. Little tiny one. So there are cocoons in here. It's keeping moisture, even though the top of it was pretty dried out. But let me get them some food and keep them rolling. All of the bins are getting overcooked rice right now because that is what we have the most of. So there's no grit in there, it's just rice. Um, so bury that under there. That should be interesting in about a week. Maybe put that little apple in there too. Um, but continue to add comments about what you think about the no grit bin. Um, so far so good, it looks like like this one actually just laid a cocoon just now. So that's pretty good. I was a little concerned they might not, or they might need it for that. Um, but let me know your comments below. Uh, this is just an experiment. Um, it does have leaves as well as paper bedding in here. And just feeding it like the rest of my normal bins, whatever it is that I have is what they get. So let me know your thoughts. All right guys, well, that's it for the no grit bin. All right guys, well, if you liked the video, give me a muddy thumbs up. If you're not already a member of my worm family, click that subscribe button. And if you wanna know what I'm doing when I'm doing it, ring that bell icon. All right guys, thanks for hanging out with me and my worms and everybody have a good day.